You've probably seen people, or you may have done it yourself, where you have doubled up on your spanners. So you get the correct size fitting spanner for the bolt or not that you were trying to undo. You then get another spanner, put that on there to get more leverage. It is very dangerous. I have seen a person using this technique and he actually snapped the jaw off that spanner. So it's not ideal doing it. Uh, you can now get an alternative. You can get a wrench extender. So I'll just give you a quick demo of exactly what I mean with these. This is the ball that we're trying to undo. And you can't undo it using the spanner because you don't have enough leverage. So what you could do is get another spanner on there. Like that, you then increase the length of the lever that you're using so you get more leverage on it so you could actually undo the bolt by doing that. But as I've already said, it is dangerous. I have seen one person snap the jaw off his spanner doing that. Rather than doubling it up, you've got a couple of options. You can use a long breaker bar to break it. You can use a flogging spanner or a flogging wrench or you can use a dedicated wrench extender like this. This is made from heavy duty forged steel. It is very strong and hopefully it will not damage the spanner when you use it because it actually grips the strong part of the spanner rather than the jaw at the end there. So once you've got that in there, you then put that on and you've got a lot more leverage so you can then undo your tight bolts using that. So that is a much better idea than doubling up on your spanners.